All right, last ending. Pretty simple. We do this again, of course. Punch. Thanks. That GI joke deserved it. Oh, you're so nice, Rick. All right then. Um, now we have to go after Doctor Kirk instead of go to the hovercraft. Now, how do we do that? We go to the um. The heliport, yeah, because Dr. Kirk's going to be there. I think that's how it works out, yeah. I think this is the most direct way to the heliport. Do I have poison darts? Oh, yeah, I do. Those Tazinos are going to get killed. I think this is the most direct way. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure it is. I don't see why it wouldn't be. All right, guys, come on. We're going to do this again for you. Special treatment. I know you like it. Just spaz and die. What about you? Are you coming? Yeah, you are. You're quite dead. See that giant level A door? You see, we have a level A security card, right? So we can open that. I'm gonna grab some more ammo, of course. Oh! I haven't opened these yet. Uh, I thought I did. I swore I did. Well, I'm gonna grab the resuscitation anyway. Uh, that's about it from there. Besides, um, Rick will give me some more grenade bullets. He always does. And here we are. I think that was the most direct way of getting here. Going the weird ramp thing. I'm not sure what purpose that serves. Maybe it's cargo, but weird. And I'm gonna want my grenade launcher. My grenade launcher. Aight. Giant door. Is it big and slow and opening slow? And it opens pretty quickly for a big door. But we walk through it really slowly, which is probably bad, right? Lag? Rag? Yes, lag, of course. Great! Wait, what the heck? This looks familiar. Well, I'm gonna fix this. Alright, did I fix the lag? Did I fix it? Did I fix it? Yeah, I fixed it. Alright. Hava. What? You cannot open or shut the door due to security precautions while cargo is moving. Wait, what? Um. Oh, alright, what? There's a sign there that apparently doesn't mean anything. Alright. Kind of redundant having two of these strange lifts and then having the elevator. I mean, not the elevator, the place we need to go. The heliport! Here we are again at the heliport. I wonder if someone's here waiting for us. Why, yes. <laughs> He's got his little dinky pistol. Fool! <laughs> Wow. Regina, what are you doing? Regina really knows how to kick some ass. I can't tell what you're saying, Rick. I caught the doctor, Rick. There's a chopper over here we can use to escape. Oh, great. I'm heading over now. Good. I'll pick you up ASAP. Hurry! That was fast. One thing you have to give them credit for in this game is that nothing really looks really pre-rendered, you know? I mean, even this helicopter, it doesn't look pre-rendered at all. It's just, it's actually there. It's not just a 2D picture. Unlike in other games. It's kind of cool. Everything looks really good in this game. I think it was a later PlayStation game. That's why. Wait, do I have the shotgun still equipped? I hope not, because that, that would be bad. Because even though poison darts kill everything in one hit, they're useless against the T-Rex. No, I got my grenades. That T-Rex is right behind us. We gotta move fast. Yeah, Let's you're really go. moving fast. Uh-oh. This looks familiar. Rick, faster! Crunch. Well, that's kind of disorienting. Rick, now! Rick, quit dawdling and do it! Alrighty then. The final battle. I've already killed you three times. Let's make it four for good measure. I hope I've got bullets equipped, because if I don't, I'm screwed. Um, 
Inventory screen. Inventory screen. As soon as I get control. Inventory screen. Inventory screen. Do I have bullets? Do I have heat bullets? No. Oh my god, what happened? I'm shooting! What happened? I'm still alive, right? Yeah! <laughs> I know you love these. Oh, reload! No! I hate reloading. Reloading sucks. Oh, great. All right. That's convenient. Wait, I'm back here. That's nice, I guess. I have to do all the cutscenes again. Well, screw that. All right, here we are again. Let's see if it goes differently this time. All right, sucker. Come on. I know you want it. Come on. Reload. I want to reload, y'all. I, uh, I don't really know how to manually reload. I just realized that. I don't know how to do that. Um, That could cause a problem because I have to reload after three shots, right? Just keep him at bay until then, all right? Shoot him. Just keep shooting at him. That was not good. Reload faster. Shoot him. Come on. Yeah, all right. That went well. Enough. Alright, let's go. Can we go a little faster, please? I think the cutscene is basically the same as the last one. And it sounds just as awful. Rick's still as good a pilot as ever. Am I getting laggy? Are, are you serious? Well, too bad. If it wants to lag, it's gonna lag. It kind of makes the audio slightly more bearable. Come on, stop lagging, come on. Be nice. Hey, it's going alright. This is taking forever. No. <laughs> I have no idea what he said, but it's hilarious. <laughs> that was a weird sound. That sounds so awful. Alright, lag, you win. You had to ruin the ending for everybody. Stupid lag. Dr. Kirk still looks depressed. We fly away into the sunset. Such a happy ending. I guess. A lot of survival horror games end like that, actually. And now this is going to sound terrible as well. If it loads. Please load. Hello. Oh god. Well, um, I don't think we're going to be able to tell the credits or anything because it's going to sound really awful. So, closing thoughts. Awesome game. I really liked it. I still like it. I'm gonna it's gonna be one of the games I keep on my computer for a while still. Maybe I'll eventually remember how to do everything. In terms of graphics, it's actually a lot better than most survival horror games because it doesn't look nearly as pre-rendered. And though the voice acting can be unintentionally hilarious, it's still slightly better than some games. <laughs> some games being Resident Evil 1. 
What else? Um, oh yeah, next let's play. If I can... I haven't tried to fix the graphical thing in a while for Silent Hill 1, but if I can fix it, I will. And uh, if I can get around to it, you should be seeing videos of it pop up sometime this weekend or next week. Early next week, like Monday. Or maybe even Sunday. Maybe tomorrow, I don't know. Depends on how everything goes. I could, you know, show you all the costumes and do Operation Wipeout and stuff like that, but I hate Operation Wipeout. Just to be honest, I don't like it. It's, it's not very fun. I would like it if this game, oh, you know, had a good combat system, but so few survival horror games actually do. So, anyway. Next up, probably Silent Hill, but if it's something else, I'll let you know beforehand. And, hope you enjoyed it. See y'all later. Excellent. You got mad skills. What games tell you that anymore? Every game should tell you that when you beat it. Every game.